Hey guys, I am just working on some Pio this morning. I am a certified instructor, but I haven't taught since I moved to Florida, which was last August, a year over a year ago. And I think I quit at the old gym a month or so before. So it's been over about, you know, over a year, a good 15 months since I've last taught Pio. So Niles and I were just doing it in the, um, you know, just kind of going over our Pio <laughs> in the, uh, for our workout this morning. And so I wanted to share with you one of my favorite Pio moves, and I wanted to see if you could do it. So if you're, it's a bird. <laughs> if, you, excuse me, <laughs> um, if you. Um, are in a position to try this move this morning. If you haven't gotten ready for work and everything, I want, hey Katie, I want you to see if you can do this one. Uh, if you are not familiar with Pio, it is um, surprisingly effective. Um, it's, it sounds like, oh, Pilates yoga. Um, it has those inspirations, but let me tell you, we were struggling and sweating this morning in the best possible way. My body needs Pio more than any, probably anything. Um, it's really about, um, Flex functional flexibility, um, but also strength, power, cardio. Um, it's just very dynamic movement that is low impact. But I mean, I, I mean, I've seen some of my best transformations in my challenge groups have been from people using the Pio program. So if it's not one that you've tried yet, um, I strongly encourage you to try that one on DVD. Um, obviously, I'm teaching the ho uh, the live format in the gyms. Um, this on you know, So if you're in Gainesville, if you're in Fl Florida, Gainesville, um, then come see me at Tioga. Um, Saturday, assuming the hurricane hasn't, you know, taken us away. So it, it could be canceled, but I'll be doing it the next two Saturdays. So I want to give you a little look at the pistol, pistol roll. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to tuck one leg under. So I'm going to hook this foot. And so I, I do Pio barefoot. Most people do, but you don't have to. Um, you just, just like anybody would on a yoga mat, but a lot of people do like to use their shoes, you know, wear shoes for more balance. But I do like, um, do it barefoot. So I hook, I hook this foot under my quad, all right, and then or my, you know, hamstring, and then I'm gonna grab on to the back of my legs, and I'm gonna roll, all right, roll, and then press up, bringing my elbow to my knee, and roll up. So you'll see this is really using the entire core, and that oblique right there. So you have to use the abdominals for that roll and that nice little oblique contraction. So I hope it's a fun move for you. It looks like fun, right? But it's, it's hard. Um, so I'm gonna, I want you to give that a try this morning. Tell me how it goes. Um, I say start with 10 at a time, you know, take a rest and then do the other side. So I'd love for you to try it this morning. Would you try it? Would you try it for me? And then tell me how you liked it. Tell me how it went for you, and I'd love for you to comment below. All right, guys, hope you're having, you have an awesome Thursday. If you're down here um, in Florida, like me, um, just um, prayers, stay safe, evacuate if you need to. We're hopefully gonna be fine here in Gainesville, not too close to the coast, so um, we're taking precautions, of course. But um, have an awesome Thursday.